Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you Aces Rug Zephyrus G14 not turning on. How do you fix it? So in this case, if you're having some problems with your laptop here or with the Aces Rug Zephyrus G14, well then in this case, there are a few things that you need to know and a few things here that you need to do. So first things first is you need to make sure that the hardware or the uh, plug or the battery is not the actual problem here which in this case you might want to check your battery or your laptop itself now if you do see it inflated it means that maybe the battery is the problem itself but if you don't see any signs of your laptop being inflated or the battery being inflated then the next thing we want to do here is you want to check your bat your actual charger itself so maybe the charger is the problem here and your laptop does no longer or no longer has any charge in it. So that's why it's not turning on. But then again, this is not a solution that you want here. So yeah, in this case, the next thing you want to do here is you want to do a soft reset here for your laptop. Now, sometimes doing a soft reset here can solve the problem itself. So what you need to do is you need to press the power button. So just an idea here, this is one of the photos from our, uh, the Zephyrus G14 here. And when we actually zoom in, we have our power button. So what you need to do here is you just need to make sure that you press and hold that for around 30, uh, 10 or 5 to 10 seconds. And in this case, it will do a soft reset on your laptop and it will might or in this case it can actually solve the, the issue itself but sometimes this might not work but yeah so the next thing you want to do here is you need to identify if the problem itself is not a software issue now if your laptop has a corrupted or a broken uh, like for example if you're using an SD, ssd or the memory for your laptop is broken then most likely it means that it won't be able to boot up because again if the memory is broken you won't be able to load up your os which in this case is going to be windows so in that case it might look like that it's not a booting up but in fill in fact it will it might have a broken memory or in this case it might have a corrupted os now in those cases you need to replace the actual memory itself which typically involves uh checking in with a, a professional which is a, a pc technician if you have those in your area and in this case uh that's about it so those are the things that you could do here to probably solve this issue and you should be good so hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to nft inspo Thank you for watching.